break it down, break it down it is We got phosphogen, aerobic, and glycolysis Supplying our muscles with that sweet ATP Yeah, it gives me that sweet essential energy Let me tell you about some things I know The three energy systems are always ready to go Activated by time and intensity It's no wonder that fit people have a much better destiny This may sound crazy But girl, you may be hazy When the body needs a burst of energy Creatine phosphate is the one who's preparing it Stored in the tissue, so it ain't no issue That's the real situation of my phosphorylation Next on the list is also known as glycolysis. Go to the map, but that's okay because it won't be missed. Using carbs for making contractions, though not very well, producing tons of lactic acid. The aerobic energy system is the boss, the pro, it gives the most for show. It uses carbohydrates and lipids to generate the most energy, it's no debate. Also known as Mr. Slow and Steady, gonna get you there when you're feeling real heavy. Making ATP, no hesitation, called oxidative phosphorylation. Now that you know about the things that we know, the three energy systems are always ready to go. One, phosphogen. Two, glycolysis. Three, aerobic metabolism. <laughs> yeah, it's always two. Activated by time and intensity, no wonder fit people have a much better destiny.